It's coming to the crunch in the South American World Cup qualifiers. The margin of error is vanishingly small for Bolivia, if they still believe they have a chance, and certainly for Uruguay. He's already warned Muslera. Oh, and presented by Quinteros. Oh, and Nandes does not accept the gift. But the first real chance of the game was gift-wrapped, really, for Nandes. Not a straightforward one. Ball going away from goal, awkward for him, but he would have hoped for better. Villarreal. Arce's ball in was... Getting the congratulations, but a horrible moment to forget for Uruguay's veteran goalkeeper and Bolivia have a deserved lead here. Well, it's Martin suggesting he got a touch, <laughs> wouldn't put it past him. But in all his years, his stellar career, Fernando Muslera has not had too many indiscretions like that. Dear me, well, Vecino can point the finger all he likes. That's a... well, Martins! <laughs> the man with the golden touch strikes again for Bolivia. And could it be that Uruguay's World Cup dreams are evaporating before our eyes? A oh, terrific first half from the men in green. And this cheap, cheap corner conceded there by Vicino proved to be really costly. Found the space, found the header. Bolivia find their way to a two-goal lead. And it is a long, long way back for Uruguay in every sense. And in their hour of need, they have turned to... Luis Suarez, who will enter the fray at the start of this second half, one of two Uruguayan changes. That could be useful. Suarez checked, because Caceres is able to get there. Suarez loitering, Lampe in trouble! And Sagredo got there in the nick of time. It's not exactly hallowed ground for goalkeepers, that penalty area. Got a deflection on it in fairness, but that could have been hugely embarrassing. The cross by Facundo Torres this time. Martins, that could be useful. Algarania, he'll get there. Was he wrestled to the ground? Yes is the answer. It is a penalty, and the card is yellow for the substitute, Gonzalez. The ball over the top, the Martins flick, clearly onside. He's wrestled to the ground inside the area. I do not know what he can possibly debate. A long wait for Marcelo Martins. affected him oh my goodness and every Uruguayan breathes an almighty sigh of relief the shuffle and well off target Perez has come out to the right side but here come Bolivia Arce well Martins is in there and Muslera, safe hands this time. Lovely floated cross by Salcedo. Martins gets there, but so does Muslera. In Numbar away, 
with Suarez in close proximity. Algaraniaz. That's painful for Diego Godin as well as Algaraniaz. The card is is it on its way? It looks like a red one. Well, Algaraniaz is dismissed for the challenge that has left Diego Godin writhing in agony. We're stretching, he's gone over the ball and there's certainly an argument. Well, I don't think that's going to be overturned. Maybe the other way might have been the better option, it's Saavedra. But there are going to be these opportunities. Salcedo. Oh, and Arce has put it away, and he's put Uruguay away. Glorious goal. And the men in blue left flat on the canvas another great ball in by Salcedo fantastic header from Arce who managed to find that space and there is no way back at all an emphatic victory for Bolivia surely now and we'll await events elsewhere to see just how severe the damage is for Uruguay, but damage it is without doubt.